Hello, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install the Ubuntu Date Picker and Time Slot app on your Shopify store. This is specifically for the new 2.0 stores, which allow for theme app extensions. To start off, we're going to have a quick look at the shop. And we have a bakery here. And on the product page, for example, I can add the date picker just above the Add to Cart button here or I could also place it on the cart page just above the checkout, about here. To get this installed, I first have to install the app itself. And once I've done this, I can go into my admin interface. And in the widget placement here, I see this little box here to enable the theme extension. And I need to select a theme here that's actually available for the new type of store. This one here is fine, that works. It's the craft theme that's compatible. And I have to decide whether I would like to place it on the product or cart page. To start off, I'm gonna place it on the product page. And I save this. And once saved, I move over to my online store theme. And here I go to the customize option. That brings me to the editor. And I navigate to the product page and in this instance I already have the date picker here from a previous install but I'm going to remove it so this is what you're going to see and if you would like to add the date picker now you go to you select this box and right here on the left hand side you can add block and in the bottom you see the date picker app if you press that, it will automatically add it at the bottom of the section. And if you would like to select the date just before the add to cart, you just move it up here above the buy button and it will move it just over there. So your customers can pick the date and then add to cart and then they will go to the checkout. If I'm saving this, I'm gonna have a look at my shop and you can now see the date pickers appearing here. The other option is, as I mentioned before, the cart page. So again, I go back to the admin here and I select cart page for the widget placement. Save that again. And in the, in the editor for the theme, I'm just gonna remove this again. I navigate to the cart page and on the cart page again the date picker has been selected previously I'm just going to remove it so when you open this for the first time it will look just like this and you can add in the subtotal block the app and that will again as previously be placed originally or initially below the checkout button we think it's better to move that up a little bit for reminding people that they have to select a date just above the checker button there. And there you go. Saving this. And now the date picker is on your checkout page. It's really straightforward, really easy to use. You can do loads of different customizations. In the date picker settings, you can also find a CSS um, adjustment here whether you would like to have a full screen one a full width one or perhaps align it differently and you can also change the size and the look of the settings so in widget settings you can find different versions for example the calendar uh, or just a drop down of available dates that's also possible this is in a nutshell how you install the theme of extension Thank you for watching and please do get in touch if you have any questions. You can also always reach out to, uh, to support and ask us questions just right here in the app at the right hand side. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.